Hi, it's Ellen Marie with Are You Integrated? And in tonight's session, we will be looking at the power of positive affirmations that help shift limiting beliefs, keeping you from being integrated. So stay with me. So thanks for joining me tonight. I'm really excited that you're here and your desire to be integrated. So what is the integration? Why do you want to be integrated? Um, integration, being integrated means that you are connected to source, that you're connected and trusting your source and you're connected and trusted to your intuition and your higher self. And that is a great place to be because it brings you more happiness, fulfillment and joy in your life. So what is unintegrated? Unintegrated is where you're just, you know, it really matters what other people think. And that is a really stressful place to be because we just really can't meet everybody else's expectations. And so tonight we're going to look at a situation of saying no. And sometimes that's pretty hard for certain people. And, um, and so let's look at how you can say no in a very integrated state um, and being in, empowered and in choice. So let's look at an unintegrated thought around saying no. I end up doing everyone else's job because I struggle to say no. I feel like uh, they take advantage of me. So here's an integrated thought process around the same situation. I let go of the assumption that saying no is wrong. I trust in my higher source to know what others need and understand that I get in the way when I assume it's always me who needs to help. When I am tired and exhausted, I know I have not been listening to my higher source. And can you see it? Can you see the difference in the integrated and unintegrated thought process around saying no? So what we need to do first, we're aware that there is an unintegrated thought and an integrated thought. And next we need to identify the limiting beliefs creating that unintegrated thought, meaning that you have stopped being connected to source and you're back in that, oh gosh, I've got to say yes to this when I really know I should say no. All right. So what are the, some of the limiting beliefs that you can see in that unintegrated thought? There could be many. So comment in the, in the box below and let me know what you saw. And I'll just give you a few of the ones that have come up for clients that I've worked with before. So one of them is self doubt, um, overachiever and victimized. And that's just a few. There could be a, a variety of limiting thoughts. So we're going to take those limiting beliefs and we're going to utilize the power of affirmations to shift those limiting beliefs. And why affirmations? Well, affirmations connect us back to source. They connect us back to our own intuition. They connect us to our higher power. And they also help to remind us of who we really are and who we are striving to become, meaning that we're letting go of those limiting beliefs. Um, and also they help to shift those limiting beliefs because you'll find that you're in that situation and you have that limiting thought, that unintegrated thought process. And all of a sudden you're like, oh wait, I have a choice here. I don't have to do what I've always done before. Okay, so let's look at the affirmations um, for those limiting beliefs. Are you ready? Get a pen and paper. You might want to write these down. All right. I let go of the assumption that saying no is wrong. I trust in my connection to source. I easily see when I am in the way of another's connection to their higher source. I confidently say no when to tasks and requests that I feel are not mine to do. I speak no with love and kindness.
Now, hopefully you feel the power or resonate with a few of those affirmations. And if you do, take those affirmations, write them down, or if you want to write all of them down, but speak those three to five times a day for the next 10 to 20 days. And you can see and feel the power of those off, uh, uh, affirmations help shift your mindset into being able to say no more often and feeling a lot more comfortable with that. So now if you're not resonating with these affirmations, because the right affirmations are really important. And so if you're not feeling it with these affirmations and you'd like to, to find that the affirmations that are right for you, we can work together. And that's where I connect with source for you to find what affirmations you need to shift your limiting beliefs around saying no. There is a link below and there's a free 30 minute consultation and I would love to meet you and talk to you. Um, and so thank you so much for joining me this evening and uh, hopefully you'll join me in the next one.